Hey, Ken Schroeder here, website designer for professional coaches. And in this video, let me show you how to add a search icon to your mobile menu using the cadence theme on WordPress. So my website, coaching sites that work.com in front of you here is on WordPress using the cadence theme. Right now you're looking at it on a desktop viewing. So this is my MacBook Air and this is the search icon. What I'm going to show you how to do is if I if I squeeze this screen down, I get the mobile viewing and I click on the little hamburger menu item and I got a search icon here. I'm going to show you how to add it there. It's not hard, but it's a little bit tricky. In fact, when I go in, I'm going to move this search icon to the top. OK, so just log into your website and I am already logged in because I have this menu bar at the top and just simply go to the customizer, which you can go to the customize button at the top of your site or if you're in the dashboard, it's on the left under appearance. Um, the tricky thing is, um, is that it's really not so much hidden in the menus to the left. The easy way, the, well, the easy way to get to it is to click on the menu at the top here. So I have the mouse, I can go through these menus here and try and find it, but it's quicker and easier just to go through here. Um, on your desktop, you just, uh, so let me just actually go to the menu, uh, the mobile menu. So if I go on the bottom left here and I click on the mobile menu item here, you can see the bottom left, the controls, it says the mobile icon. So this gives me the mobile viewing. And from, from here, when I go ahead and click on the, um, the little edit item, so basically the hamburger will, all, the hamburger little toggle menu will be here. It's by default what's there for mobile menus. Um, and if I click on the little pencil here, because I scrolled over it, then I can edit some of the settings there. So here's the tablet mobile menu. And so here down below, um, there's this thing on the right called the trigger. That's this, um, when you click on this, it triggers and opens this bigger menu that's off the canvas. You see here on the left off the canvas. And in here I have a menu the mobile navigation, as well as a search toggle. This search toggle I can delete. And then if I go here to the menu here, um, and I click on it, it'll, it won't show the search icon. So basically to add that, I would just click this little icon here. I'm sorry, I just go down here and click on the plus and then search toggle. That's all there is to it. I can move this above the menu, which I'm going to do. So I'll just drag it above here. So now it's a search menu, search toggle, and the mobile menu are in the off canvas area that's triggered by this thing on the right. That's why it's a little tricky. I could click on the icon here and maybe mess around in here and try and find it. Um, drawer container options. I'm not so sure, but the fast, I'm not going to mess around there. But for the fastest way to do it, just, just over here and it says off canvas. And that's what this trigger does. I might add other things over here. Next to the trigger, I can put a button and that'll show up in the menu up top. But I'm not going to mess around too much to confuse you. The whole point is, oops, I deleted that. Let me delete the button. Let me add back in the trigger. There's the trigger and it's the off, it, off canvas is there. And if I click on the thing here, you can see there's the search box. That's all there is to it. Easy peasy. Okay, so I'll just click publish to make that, uh, to make that active. And then I'll close this. And you should test it on your phone as well to confirm it. But right now I'm just looking at this browser tab. Um, I'm gonna drag the menu close. My menu um, shorter in width. It's a quick way of testing the mobile. And there is my search icon. Colors. I do a search and I get, you know, it gives me some blog posts and pages, mostly blog posts. Anyway, there you go. And that's it. Easy peasy.